My phone's set up with everything. Of course, hello, champ. Get out this tweet. Bam! Come watch at Bam. Wham, bam. Tweet is out. Thank you, ma'am. And hello, Shiro. Hello, Jimbo. Welcome. Now, as you saw there earlier, and it is officially... Oh, God. What now, Mini Makoto? What is it? Hit me. Let me see it. <laughs> okay. Uh, thank you, Mini Makoto. Um, but yes, as we all know, uh, it is a new month-long uh, go-round, a new series of like eight shows. Uh, in the G1 Wrestling Universe before the next pay-per-view, which is totally screwed, by the way, is the next pay-per-view. Uh, it was the one, uh, the big wrestling thing, one of the last ones made by Screw Attack, so I ripped that off. And I'm keeping it alive here on the G1 Wrestling Universe because, well, it's just too good to let die because it's actually really, really good. It's a really good name. Um... So, yes, and also, uh, another thing I want to say, uh, that after Totally Screwed, after the, uh, after that pay-per-view, after basically a month's time, once it is over, I'm not changing anything. I'm not adding anything. So, basically, after Totally Screwed, is basically we'll be getting into the twilight of the 2K17 uh, series here heading into 2K18. So uh, after Totally Screwed, we'll be in that home stretch. So therefore, any and everything that I will accept and everything that I will make will be for 2K18. Okay, so... I have already, I will tell you right now, I've already made some stuff. Very few. It's very, 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 very few. Uh, but I already, I have, for 2K18, I already have uh, pretty much all the logos and stuff to create a majority of things uploaded. Now, some of the stuff for personal uh, people, like personal G1s, I don't have uploaded, like, uh, for example, I can't create Woody Man yet because I don't have, like, the wood patterns that I need uploaded. I didn't upload them. But, like, for example, as you see on screen right now, the screw attack uh, symbol and all that type of stuff, I have that type of stuff uploaded. All that's done and good. So, there's that. And also, as I switch over here, and you're going to see it when I switch over. We are starting this as well. You might have saw it when I first came online. But there it is. Going to pop up again. The boss bar is back. To where you have to defeat me once again. To get. The pay-per-view early. But here's the thing. I'm giving you all month to do this. Now what I did uh, this time. Instead of giving it like the default health. As you can see there, when it was up, it has basically it. I I punched in the health. Just I slammed down the numbers keys is what I did. All right, that's all I did. It's like bam, 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 and that's what came up. So that's the health. Uh, <laughs> so once you defeat me, and there is a new boss, uh, that means you will get the pay per view early. But remember, you have to defeat me before the pay-per-view and this I will have that up on all my streams so it doesn't matter when or where I stream uh, 
whether it's playing Space Buddies with fucking Short Bus, whether I'm doing this show right here, or I am, you know, doing one of those creation streams with two... With uh, 2K18. Basically, there's plenty of time to... 350 bucks? For, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, that's... That, that, no. Uh-uh. No. You see? No. No, that's wrong, Winnie Makoto. No. 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 That is too much. I would never charge that fucking much. No. That's dumb. Okay. Because what you can do... Uh, to cause damage to the boss is every every okay here's here's the thing every follow every bit and every subscriber does damage to the boss but you see here's the thing they aren't worth one point of damage okay that's where you're wrong. I will tell you this. A follow, considering uh, considering it's uh, just a follow, that is worth one bit. Because I get a bunch of random follows. But subscribers, like if you subscribe, that causes a lot more damage than a follow. I don't want to tell you how much... Because, obviously, people like to do the math. But now, if ultimately you can figure it out from people donating, like fucking Jimbo, god damn it. Jimbo doing that right there, doing damage already with 250 bits. Knocking that box bar down a little bit. Because like I said, remember, every stream I do, that'll be up. You have a full month to get rid of that bar. And I just set the boss number just random. Just bam on the keyboard. That's why the you know, that's why it is what it is. Because I didn't want to seem like Shiro said, I don't want to seem like a greedy fuck. And I made the bits damage, considering how much I string. Trust me, I put way too much fucking thought into this than I should have, considering how much I charged in the past, and blah, 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 blah. But that's not important. That's not important. It's there for you to get the pay-per-view early and everything else. What do you need, son? What you need? Oh, okay. So, you got that to look forward to. Uh, another month of new rivalries, new shows. Gotta beat the boss. It'll be up for every stream. And don't forget. And, oh, thank you, Shiro, for five bits as well more damage done but also unlike a regular stream uh, uh, on on my wrestling show stream if you'll notice the boss bar will eventually fade away after like a couple seconds so uh, but on a regular stream when I do like elite dangerous or a creation stream or something I'll just leave it up there for you to see so, to know it's there. Uh, so anyway, what do you say we go ahead and we get started with the uh, with the show, and we get into it here.
Hello, everybody, and welcome to a new round here at the Screw Attack Knockback, brought to you by the G1 Wrestling Universe. We are here today, and we got plenty of action coming right your way. We got singles matches, we got multi man matches, we got everything, including a title match as your main event. We got a rematch coming between Team Omni and the Blitz team for the title match at Death Battle was not enough, was not conclusive enough. We are going to have a regular old good old title match for you right here today, live on the Screw Attack Knockback. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you're ready for that and much, much more here on the G1 Wrestling Universe because we are doing it and we are doing it live. And you got the best seats in the house right where you are right now to see all the action. So again, hope you're ready for what you're in store for. Oh yeah, one thing I also forgot to mention is that whoever the next boss after me and you guys get totally screwed uh, early, if you can defeat defeat that boss like quickly, whoever it might be, it's like say it's Shiro or something. If you can defeat defeat Shiro, you you I'll go ahead, you know, you'll get the next one free as well. I forgot to mention that. Showdown and SGC. Okay, so you have the ability to get... It's like, if you can do it fast enough, if you can defeat, like, four bosses, you can get all of those pay-per-views early. As quickly as you can defeat those bosses before the pay-per-view or the matches for leading towards those pay-per-views have even started.
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are starting things off right here on the screw attack knockback. It looks like we got, well, it's supposed to be boomstick in action, but it looks like we got both the death battlers coming out. Thing, uh, runs a foul of this match here with both the death battlers with and boomstick out here but well, there you already see boomstick is ready very confident and oh looks like Sean Hines doing the smart thing bringing back up as well He's got his uh, teammate with him, Chad James. Smart decision, especially seeing uh, that his teammate with him, or Wiz, as they are going to go one-on-one. -on -one. Surprising, uh, seeing the members of Screw Attack taking on the Death Battlers. Uh, Death Battle being a big thing at Screw Attack. A lot of times too big, too popular, some people might say, but looks like Sean Hines here, though, out to possibly put Boomstick in his place, but oh, not starting off good for Boomstick. Has control of this match, Sean Hines and Chad James looking at his partner from the outside. There we go, Sean Hines now looking a little better. And oh, some damage to the leg right there. But uh oh, nope, boomstick. Boomstick, uh, nice retaliation. Now, nice series of back and forth between those two. Oh, Sean Hines sweeping that leg, just crushing it right here. Now, climbing up to the second rope, and boom! Nails boomstick. And oh, dragging the arm. Taking him straight down to the match. Boomstick there. And oh, running knockout punch. Boomstick knowing how to deal the damage, but now Sean Hines coming back, throwing him off the ropes he goes. And oh, no, a elbow stopping that momentum right where it started. And back down, Sean Hines goes. And Wiz there on the outside looking, seeing things, liking what he sees, especially with that knee right to the face. But uh-oh, oh, take down quickly. Sean Hines trying to get back into the swing of things here. Oh, dropping the elbow right on the spine of Boomstick. What are we gonna see here? Sean Hines rolling him over. Oh, gonna try for a cover. Could this be enough to put him away? But no, no it is not, only a two count here. First count here, first cover in this match. John Hines, oh, quick right hand, trying to keep Boomstick on his toes now in the corner. Uh-oh, nope, nope, nope. Oh, Boomstick meeting 
that steel pole here on the outside. And now whoop, arm drag, take down. Goes boomstick on the offensive here. Now, now boomstick climbing to the second rope and oh, manages to hit him all the way in the center of the ring. But Sean Hines back up, grabbing him, putting him right there into the corner. And oh, nope. Boomstick fighting out of that and oh my goodness. Battering him with that headbutt there from Boomstick. Now we got to cover one. Oh no, kick out right at two. Sean Hines still in this fight. And oh, nice elbow right to the gut and back up he goes. And oh, he's got the arm. Oh my goodness, what is this? Oh man, down goes Boomstick once more. They're each trying to put each other away, do anything they can to get that three count as we got another cover, but only a one this time. Oh, big left to get Sean Hines off of him, but he blocks the right. Sean Hines now battling back. Holy cow, Sean super kick. And no. Boomstick seemingly fired up here now. Oh, into the corner right past the ref. And no, Sean Hines. And whoa, up over. Boomstick goes off the rope. Swing and a miss by Sean. Ah! Oh, forearm right to the forehead. Boomstick just laying out Sean Hines there. Now stomping on the midsection, but oh, Boomstick gets an elbow to that same midsection. And oh, an elbow to the face here, Boomstick. Now with a right, and oh my God. The knees to the back quickly into a cover. Here we go, one, two, is Sean Hines not out yet? No, it is only a two. But Boomstick is ready, he's waiting. And oh, oh, a Boomstick beat down. Oh, ending with that big uppercut. Going into the cover, two. And oh, Sean Hines finds the strength to get that shoulder up. Now Sean dragging him down onto one knee. Sean Hines grabbing him. Oh, nice suplex right there. Now Sean Hines seeming to uh, gain control of this match. Now has the leg once again. Oh, legs not meant to bend that way. Right in the face of Wiz there. And oh, another shot, super kick. Down goes Boomstick. And we get the hook of the leg and one, and two, and no. Sean can't quite believe what's going on. It's two super kicks now, but Boomstick not staying down, but Sean Hines ready, waiting for him to get up. He's got him, and oh, Sean Hines. Down goes Boomstick once again. Is that enough? He gets the two and the three. And Wiz, not too happy. Chad ecstatic, though. Taking out Boomstick there. If we take a look here. Look at some of these uh, replays. There's the, oh, the elbow right to the back. And, oh, there's this headbutt. Just, oh, that big hard head of, of Boomstick. Elbow to the face in the right hand, and now the elbows. Oh my goodness. Then, of course, you had the beat down. Oh, ending with that uppercut. That vicious, vicious uppercut. That was nothing here. After this, getting the three count. Here he is, your winner. Sean Hines to start things off here on the screw attack. Knocked back the big man from Screw Attack himself, Sean Hines, getting a victory over Boomstick. Though, if I know anything about the death battlers, this is not over.
sweet scent. Good to go. All right, everything looks good and loaded as well. Let's get into this here, everybody. Bam. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are back here once again after Sean Hines taking out Boomstick. We are back now with another man from Screw Attack known as Ben Singer. You no know, big bad Ben going to be going one on one here with uh, one of the more recent additions to the Duo on Wrestling Universe, Greg Miller from Kinda Funny. Not seeing a lot of action. There he is, right there. Big Bad Ben, he's ready. And now, here he comes. Greg Miller from Kinda Funny. And anywhere else on the internet, you don't want him. Game over, Gregory. spirits here Let's hope he can stay that way and Ben looking at non none too worried here about what is about to take place and there's the bell so let's see what they got here oh Ben immediately going after the arm and holy cow Ben just twisting away down goes Greg now but oh nope Miller now with the Elbow and oh, the knees to the face. Greg Biller not taking this lightly then with that kick to the back. And nope, Ben. Oh, shoulder takedown right there. Ramming that shoulder right into him, but now just back and forth between these two. Oh, the kick and the reversal. Oh, man. Oh, repeated right hands. Now down goes Greg Miller. And now, uh oh. Oh, nice slam right there from Greg Miller. And now, quickly out of that. So big, bad Ben still on the ropes. And oh, low blow from Greg Miller there. Ben still down. Going to get up, but Miller waiting for him. He's got him. And oh, my gosh. Rung his bell just as Ben would. Now rolling him over. He stole his move. And now here we are, one, two, and no. Oh, kick right to the back there, now stomping. Stomping away, and there's a reversal from Ben. And now, oh, he's got him. Oh my goodness, oh no, a reversal from Ben. 
Need him right in the top of the skull there. But now Ben, he scoops him up. Oh, the Ben beat down right to the side. Now just tossing him away like a piece of trash. And now he hooks that leg, one. And there's two, but only getting a two count here. As now he ties him up. Now elbows to the top of the head there. Ben in control of this match. Oh, he doesn't seem too worried. Going to take a little break in the corner as Miller trying to get back to his feet. Now from behind. Oh, my goodness, the camel. Oh, clutch. Takedown right there, it looked like. Had a bit of a bad angle, but now, uh-oh, Ben, he's got Greg Miller on the ropes. And now, oh, throwing him right through those ropes. Now to the outside. Now, oh, Ben, what are you doing? Off the ropes, jumping through. Oh, my God, the DDT through the ropes here on the outside. Ben, crazy, doing everything to take out. Greg Miller now back into the ring, going for a cover. There's only a two. After all that, only a two count. What is Greg Miller made of? So now Ben trying to go on the offensive once more, but oh, Miller with that arm trying to break it right out of the socket. And oh no, another bottom blow from Greg Miller right there on those tender muscles on, under the leg there. But Ben toughing it out, back on his feet, and oh, now off the ropes, and oh, a kick, and again, and swing, oh, he catches him. Oh, the neck breaker, down goes Miller once again. Oh, he catches him takes him down now he's already got that leg hooked and here comes the ref two only a two count Ben just can't understand what's going on so I think we're going to get another big Ben beat down oh but he blocks the right hand firing back here oh Ben catches that leg and oh who knees him right in the face because now Ben he's up on the shoulders but, oh, elbows. Miller, Greg Miller with the elbows right to the face of Ben here. But Ben once again grabbing hold and, oh, throwing him across the ring as we quickly cover one. And there's two, but again, he kicks out. Now Ben uh, trying to decide exactly what he's going to do next, what he's got to do to take down Greg Miller, but Miller now with the uppercut. And oh, bit quick, swift right hand. And now another takedown has been back on the offensive. And oh, again, taken down. And now Ben tries to cover once again, but no, quickly, swiftly gets out. Ben little, looking a little flustered little perplexed why he will not stay down. Now back to his feet and oh, again, Miller, Greg Miller blocks. And oh, he rakes the eyes and oh, again, that bottom blow down below for Greg Miller. And then, oh, oh, oh my God, repeated kicks right to the face. But Ben with the reversal here. He is not down and out yet. He's got him and just wings him across the ring one more time. Now he's trying again to put away Miller. Greg only staying down for two. And now, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, he's got him. He's up. Oh, no. Not again. No. Oh, okay. Now he quickly grabs that leg. And now one. And now two. And three. He does it. 
Greg Miller takes out Big Bad Ben from Screw Attack. Oh, with moves like that, how could he not stay down there? Oh, man. Using his own move against him. But even after Ben diving out of the ring for that DDT. There he is, your winner, Greg Miller. And of course, don't forget everybody, we still got more to come, including a tag team title rematch for our main event. So I hope you all stay tuned and stick around for that. And much, much more coming up here on the Screw Attack Knockback. Uh, Greg, uh, Mr. Greg Miller won, Vork. Is Greg Miller? He managed uh, to get the victory. on the wrong damn thing. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back here. We're near and halfway through our program. We are only on the third match, and it is a grand one is now. First coming out here in this fatal four-way, we got Gerardo, the hybrid ring as he's known, on the online sphere. Always been a big contender no matter what match he's in, and I'm sure this will be no different as the next superstar, one of the next competitors coming out here. Chaos now. Ever so creepily coming down to the ring. But as he makes his way quickly down to the ring, we are getting on with things here. As we got two more competitors to come out. And oh dear. And it is Tiger Mask. Haven't seen him in quite some time, but here he comes. But he is here. But now, who is the last competitor here? Tiger Mask is ready, and oh dear! It is the G1 to be feared. Woody Man hasn't been in action for quite some time after his involvement with the G1 Championship and some other things here in the G1 Wrestling Universe. Woody Man's here. Chaos is here. Everybody's here. Now, who's going to win this big fatal four way match as people claw and climb their way up the ranks? Here, looking for a number one contender, looking for a spot, looking to stand out, possibly to get a shot at any title here in the G1 Wrestling Universe. And Chaos, immediately thrown out of the ring by Tiger Mask, is Woody. Taking on Gerardo. Oh, but Gerardo fighting back. And now, uh oh, chaos on the outside with a nice German suplex. And Gerardo just going the to town on Woody inside. As also, uh, though you may not be aware, there's actually currently a uh, open challenge after he won the title from Red Row for the WGC title. So I wouldn't be surprised if any of these competitors possibly step up to that challenge in the near future. Though I've heard there's already been one person to step up. 
Matt is going to actually be on the game attack takedown. But here, on the outside and on the inside of the ring, just brutal, brutal things happening. As Chaos and Tiger Mask on the outside. And, uh oh, Woody, what are you doing? What are you doing on the top? Oh, he sees his target as another suplex. And oh, crossbody off the top from Woody. And the suplex is on the outside from Chaos to Tiger Mask. And there we go, Tiger Mask fighting out. Fighting back as Gerardo does the same inside and off the second rope, but he misses Woody quickly out of the way. And now we already got to cover Gerardo kicking out immediately, not staying down, still in this fight, quickly making Woody Man miss with that kick, and uh-oh, chin breaker on Woody. Hope he didn't need that. And oh my goodness, Tiger Mask on the outside, just trying to obliterate chaos. As Woody Man now once again, oh my goodness, what are you doing? Oh man, dropping the knee, Tiger Mask on the outside, but Gerardo again fighting back. And oh, off the table, Tiger Mask bounces. And again, a swing and a miss with that kick, and now from behind, he's got him. Nice backdrop there, as now Chaos is finally in control with an elbow to the back of Tiger Mask on the outside. And now, uh-oh. Woody, oh, driving the knee and the leg right there into the mat and stomping on the back and everything else here. And oh, again, Woody just in firm control here. Inside the ring, gonna try again to cover Gerardo, two and only a two count. And oh, Chaos tried to go in and divert his tension, but Tiger Mask would not allow it. And now, uh oh, Tiger Mask on the outside. Oh, with a Tiger Bomb, down goes Chaos. Oh, nope, missing with that kick, and now into the ring goes Chaos, but Tiger Mask helping him along with an elbow to, I believe, the bleeding head. And now, oh, from behind. Oh, Tiger Mask interrupting everything. Now, oh, just going to town with a vicious combo on Gerardo, the kicks. Oh, and down he goes, and now he turns his attention to Woody Man. Oh my God, Tiger Mask clearing house here. Gerardo is down and oh, stomping away, but here comes Chaos, but Tiger Mask sees him, takes him down immediately, scoops him up, but no, there's a reversal from Chaos. Tiger is down. Now Chaos whipping Tiger Mask into the corner. Here he comes and no. Reversal up, over, around. He goes now off the rope, swinging a miss by Tiger Mask. As, oh no, he is interrupted by the other men in the ring here. Not gonna let it happen. As now Woody and Gerardo back at it, though they are now outside of the ring here. The chaos in control inside the ring. And oh, there's a reversal from Gerardo on the outside doing his best to take down Woody with that DDT on the outside. And oh, down goes Tiger Mask as we get a cover. One, two, is this it? No, Tiger Mask kicks out as the hand was coming down. And oh, kick to the face. Action is hot and heavy inside the ring here as Gerardo and Woody Man battle it out on the outside. And now, uh-oh, Chaos on that middle rope. And oh my goodness, what is this? He's down and, oh, driving the knee deep into Chaos. Is now Woody Man has Gerardo. 
Oh, no, there's two, and oh, Chaos kicks out right at two, right in the nick of time. But Woody Man, hot on the heels of Gerardo here, who now goes out of the ring. And now Woody Man sets his sights on Tiger Mask. And Chaos is just fine with all of that help. And down goes Tiger Mask, but now Woody Man sees Chaos, sees what needs to be done. And Woody Man, no, he doesn't get to do it. As we get a reversal, and oh my goodness, down goes Woody, but Chaos holding on. As now Gerardo and Tiger Mass try to get up. Gerardo finally back on his feet, but Chaos goes for a cover. And Gerardo breaking that up. And now Chaos sit, careening to the outside. And oh no, oh no, Titan fall, elbow. The Titan has fell, fell on Woody Man. Now the cover, the two, and no, Woody. He kicks out and a reversal, dragging him down to the mat. Now Woody Man sending Gerardo into the corner. Now, uh oh, Woody Man, what are you doing? He scoops him up. Oh no, he ties him up right there in the corner. Oh, down he goes. Woody Man looking a little bit exhausted. Same with Chaos. Though regains his composure. Woody Man, he sees Tiger Mask. He's Tiger pulling himself up. Woody, oh, into the corner, but Tiger Mask fights out. But it's two on one situation. Woody Man says no. He sees Chaos, throws him into the corner, and out of the ring goes Tiger Mask. No, no, Chaos in the corner. Oh, no, Woody Man, he's setting up for the splinter in the corner. Boom! Down goes Chaos. And now Gerardo back in this match here. Taking out Woody Man, he's on the outside now. Got to rest up as now Chaos continues to fight on. But Gerardo has him sending him into the corner. And up he goes, oh my goodness, Chaos, boom! Right into that turnbuckle. But Gerardo is not done yet. Russian leg sweep down goes Chaos. And now, oh, an elbow to the face, Tiger Mask. Now reversal from Gerardo, and now another re reversal from Tiger Mask, back and forth between these two superstars here. Oh my God, Tiger Mask from behind. And now Tiger Mask taken down, as now Woody Man is back in, he's got him, oh my goodness. The verticality, and down goes Gerardo, holy cow. Tiger Mask doing his best to try and get up. Gerardo trying to make a comeback here. As Chaos finally able to get to his feet. And oh no, he's got him submission hold. And no, Chaos breaking that up as quick as it gets put on. And now out to the outside goes Chaos. Woody Man now pushing Gerardo away, getting him off of him. Is now Tiger Mask on the outside here. Oh no, oh my God. The power bomb here on the outside as Woody and Gerardo go at it inside here. And now, oh, Tiger Mask taken down, rolling to the outside, chaos. And now, uh oh, Woody, he's setting up for the spike. He gets it, but now Woody has his sights set. And oh, through the ropes. There's now chaos 
is the one in control of this match here inside the ring. Now, Tiger Mask sees chaos. Oh, he takes down Shiro, or not Shiro, rather, uh, Gerardo. And now Chaos has Tiger Mask, who's bleeding at this point. And then, oh my God, off the ropes. Holy cow, Chaos. Now all four men inside the ring here. Now Gerardo sending Chaos all on his way to the outside. And Tiger Mask taken down Woody Man. No, 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 Tiger Mask has Woody Man in his sights. Oh, he's got him. Oh, no, the Tiger Suplex. Woody's shoulders are down, but no, Woody struggling out of that as quickly as he can. And oh! Now Tiger Mask following Woody to the outside. Now, okay, Tiger Mask getting Woody Man back inside where he needs to be. Oh, helping him with an elbow to the face to help him along the way back inside the ring. And now, uh oh, here comes Gerardo though. As he has laid out Tiger Mask with Woody. And now Gerardo from behind, Chaos trying to get back up after being laid out by Gerardo. We got a cover. Two, only a two. And uh oh, here comes Chaos finally back in on the action as Gerardo throws him into Woody. Doesn't have any effect. There's, oh, he's got the arm all wrapped up. Submission here. But Tiger Mask puts an end to that as he stomps away to break that up. And now Woody Man has his eyes on the Tiger Mask prize here. And oh, sending him to the outside right in front of that official's table on the outside. As now Gerardo sends Chaos packing here. And now Gerardo going to meet Woody and Tiger here on the outside. And now a reversal. And now Gerardo with Tiger Mask. Oh, but Tiger retaliates right there with that reversal. And now Tiger with the all oh, with an elbow. Now in the ring goes Tiger Mask. But Woody, he's on top of the situation here. Oh, he's got him. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. Oh, what a vicious wooden nail to take him down with right there. But Tiger Mask not out of this yet as Gerardo continues to stomp Chaos into the ground on the outside. And oh, my goodness. Oh, Tiger Mask taking out Woody with his own maneuver. And now Tiger Mask, Woody Man fighting it out inside. And now here comes Chaos. Climbing up to the top. Where is he going? Oh, he's got his eyes set on Gerardo on the outside. Oh, my God. And now Woody Man is still standing inside the ring. He's the only one left going to the outside now. As Gerardo being bounced off of that steel pole. And oh, now Chaos is head bounced off the barrier here on the outside. And now Woody Man being all oh, thrown into the steel pole right on top of Gerardo. Gerardo crawling out from under Woody here. And now Woody Man with chaos. Gerardo back up. And Tiger Mask back up both. All four men. Everybody inside the ring. And oh, nice suplex. And a reversal from Tiger Mask. Who now, uh oh, Tiger going out, climbing swiftly like a cat. 
off the top, but oh, there's a stump. Chaos got stumped. Woody Man now, as Tiger Mask keeps trying to get all, oh, but there. Woody Man trying to run away with the victory, but Tiger Mask stopping it in his tracks. And now, whoa, out goes Woody Man. And now, oh no, oh man, right into that steel pole once again goes Gerardo. And now, into the ring, Woody Man, Gerardo. And now, last but not least, in comes Tiger Mass. Tiger with chaos all wrapped up. What are we going to see here? He's got him swinging him around right into a neck, neck breaker. Gerardo setting up Woody Man as we get only a two count. And out goes Chaos. As, oh, Tiger sees Gerardo. Woody out. They're on the top rope. And oh, off the ropes. Boom, there goes Gerardo. And Woody Man. Oh, no. Tiger Mask just out of his reach with that flying elbow. And now Tiger Mask out the top. Oh, Tiger misses. Gerardo gets up and out of the way. And Gerardo taking advantage of this situation. And now one, two, three men back in the ring. Gerardo saying no. And now, uh-oh, Woody, he's got Tiger Mask, but he grabs Chaos instead. Chaos didn't even see it coming. Chaos gets stumped. And now Woody got his sights set on Tiger Mask. And oh, off the rope and face first into the mat. Down goes Tiger Mask. And now Woody covering Chaos for the victory. Is this it? There's two and no. Chaos somehow, some way able to kick out. And oh, there's an elbow. But Gerardo is up. He's back into this match here, waiting patiently to take his moment to strike. And oh, the wooden nail quickly, swiftly. Here comes Gerardo now. And oh, trying to twist that head apart from its body. Now Gerardo, oh, he's got him. Oh, the Titan drop, boom, down goes Woody. As now Chaos being flung to the outside. And now here comes Gerardo. And oh, flinging him down to the ramp area now. It's Woody Man trying to get back up using the rope. He's back up now as Gerardo and Chaos, there we are. They're making their way back to the ring here. As now Woody Man goes outside. And Tiger Mask gets chased, but oh, thrown into the barrier. But oh, elbow coming back here. Tiger Mask now being thrown inside the ring. And now, whoa, Tiger Mask. Incredible agility right there. As Gerardo and Chaos continue to beat each other here on the outside. Oh my goodness, now Gerardo and oh, oh, the Tiger bomb inside. He doesn't let go. One, there's two, and three does it. He does it, Tiger Mask taking out Woody Man Gerardo. Just one second too late. Incredible match for all four of these men here. As we take a look at some of these freaking replays. Holy cow. Nearly everybody bleeding. There you go. Oh, the finishing Tiger Bomb. There he is. He's a little bloody, but victorious nonetheless. Tiger Mask. Stay tuned. We finally got the ladies coming up next here in the G1 Wrestling Universe. We'll see everybody then.
So stay tuned. Damn, that was a hell of a match. <laughs> And also, let's not forget, uh, before we move on to the next match, thank you, Short Bus Eric, for that resub doing some big damage, uh, if I'm not mistaken, to the... Okay, all right, we are back here now. This is G1 Wrestling Universe. Screw attack, knockback now, love.
But here's the thing, she's got quite a match on her hands here. Trouble, but ultimately came out victorious in the table match days ago at the pay-per-view death battle. Now going to go one-on-one -on -one with uh, Hyper Combo here now. Oh! They tie up here in the middle of the ring and oh! Relic Raider taking down Hyper Combo here and reversal. Back around she goes, and oh my god, down goes Relic Raider as Hyper Combo. Oh, big right hand right to the face there. Is now Relic Raider twisting that arm. The champ in control here has firm grips on that arm, but oh no. Now we got a reversal. The champ not looking good here. Now down on the ground. As that arm is twisted and oh what what's she doing when oh my goodness that is not supposed to happen to your arm that is now uh hyper combo here swinging her around the ring oh an uppercut now relic raider fighting back here drop kick nailing vicky right there taking her down now stomping in what it looks like, for some reason, Mini Makoto is out here now. And, whoa, twisting. Down goes Relic Raider. Now Mini Makoto sitting there at ringside. And, oh, down goes. And a reversal. Up she comes. And a running DDT. And now, oh, the leg drop. And now, oh my goodness, the belly to belly slam. Down goes Vicky. And oh, nailing her with that super kick. Minnie Makoto not liking what she's seeing here. As we get a one, a two, and only a two count. Vicky able to, oh, kick out, not able to dodge that. Drop kick to the back. And oh, shot to the gut. That's not good enough as, again, Relic Raider in control of this match. As though Though Mini Makoto there on the outside seeming to cheer on uh, Vicky here. And oh, misses that time with that drop kick to the back. And now, uh oh, again with a belly to belly slam. And oh, no. The champ in control here. And oh. And oh my goodness. That incredible maneuver right there. Going for the cover now. This has got to be it. We got one, two, and oh, Mini Mikoto interfering with the match here.
pulls out the ref, allowing Vicky here to get a moment of the upper hand, now sending the champ off the ropes. And oh my God, that uppercut. She fell right into it. The hyper combo. Oh my goodness, up on her shoulders here. Oh, dropping her right down to the mat. Now Relic Raider, oh, face first into the mat she goes. And oh, Vicky making a comeback here. Oh, a kick. Down goes Relic Raider quickly. She grabs that leg. One, two, but no, the champ still in it to win it, kicking out at two, and oh, kick to the back. Though, Relic Raider quickly up, and oh, down goes Hyper Combo. And oh my goodness, got her all cradled and stretched in ways she's not meant to here in this submission maneuver here. Is she gonna tap? Can she find the strength somehow to get up? Yes, oh, rolling out as best she can. Damage done though, and now oh, quickly into now a leg drop. Giving it everything they got, oh no. Oh, the right hand. Now, whoa, that hyper DDT, holy cow. Oh, now the elbow right to the sternum. That hyper combo DBT, DDT right there. Looks like Relic Raider might be out. But no, she's trying to get up. And oh, she's got the arm, trying to break it right out of the socket, doesn't do it though. And oh no. And again with the power bomb. And now here we are. We got a cover. Is that enough to take Hyper Combo down? And only a two count. And oh, got her all wrapped up, but no. Vicky able to wiggle her way out. She's back to her feet. And now, what is this? She's got her, pushes her away. Sheer brute strength here. One, two, but no, only a two count. Looking a little bit on the tired side, needs to get a little bit more energy, but oh, Relic Raider taken that moment of uh, opportunity to take a breath. Now laying her out with the belly to belly slam, but she's not done. And oh no, a reversal. And neither is Vicky now and oh, a knee. And now, oh, what is this and oh, the splash. As now Vicky standing, waiting, catching her breath, deciding what she can do next is Relic Raider now using the ropes. Oh, quickly with the elbow. And oh, that super kick out of nowhere. Laying out hyper combo there. She hooks the leg. Is that good enough? Is that two, three, does it? Regardless of Minnie Makoto's interference, which I'm sure Relic Raider not happy about, the champ able to still get the victory. There's your victor, still champion in the ultimate victory here. Relic Raider, as we still got more coming up next, including that tag team title rematch. So stay tuned everybody, there's more coming your way.
<laughs> Only been used by Shawn Michaels. Oh.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Now it looks like you're due on champ. Silent Hero has come out here. He's got a microphone in his hand. After defending his belt and taking out Ryan Haywood, looks like he has something uh, to say to us uh, here to today. All right. So what do you say? We give our champ a listen. There you are, it's a silent hero setting the bar for what's to come here. What the fuck was that? Hear that rope coming? <laughs> <laughs> You're the champ, though, Silent Hero. I don't... That's weird. I mean, uh So, I mean, don't worry, champ. I mean, everybody, I mean, if I think I put it on there, everybody is just going to see your attire when the, the thing comes up, and they'll see what it is.
it's got an animal it has Didn't hit that in time. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are here now. Once again, as we got more G1 Women's Division action coming your way. As we got this lady right there, Joanna Chase. Coming out, as you uh, might remember, she unfortunately lost her chance at the women's title unable to come out the victor there but today she's going to possibly going to be taking on a much worse foe here tonight in the name of mini makoto And all right, here she comes, her opponent. Waving two people there. All right, everybody looks like they're ready, willing, able to get things going. All right, there's the bell, and we are off. And immediately, Minnie Makoto taking Joanna, putting her right there in the corner. Oh, but swinging a miss. Joanna Chase ducks. Now, Mini Makoto finally on the offensive, and oh my goodness. Now, grabbing her, sending her off the rope, she goes, and oh, drop kick right to the chest. And oh, quick punch to the gut. Joanna Chase back up, she goes. And whoa, round and round Mini Makoto went, but ultimately down she'll stay. And oh, big splash right there. Mini Makoto still down. Off the rope and oh, Mini Mikoto up out of the way. Does not get hit at all right there. Quick thinking by Mini Mikoto now. In control, taking advantage. Nice, quick, hard suplex right there for Mini Mikoto. And now, okay, Mini Mikoto, boom. Trying to dismantle the arm. And now Mini Makoto, what are you doing? Mini taking Mini Makoto taking off the turnbuckle here now. And oh, she's up and oh, turn around and oh my goodness. Nice takedown there. Incredible athleticism from Mini Makoto here so far. And now Mini Makoto got her. And oh, she's got her. 
She's going down, Joanna Chase. Mini Makoto right rolling over into a cover. Could this be it? There's two. Ah, uh, no, not quite yet. Joanna Chase able to take on the champion. Not going to go down quite yet. And there she goes. Joanna Chase finally on the offensive here. Now climbing up to the second turnbuckle. Off she goes, but no, Minnie Mikoto, she knows her way around the ring, can get out of the way of that right quickly. And now Minnie Mikoto tossing Joanna into the corner. And oh my goodness. Joanna chases down, laying across that bottom rope. Minnie Mikoto to the outside, she's backing up. Oh no, Minnie Mikoto, oh man. She's down, she hooks the leg. Is that good enough? She's got the two, and that is all she's getting. Swing and a miss with that kick. Joanna Chase up now from behind. She's got her roll up. Oh, no, no roll up. Boom, kick right to the side of the head right there. Now she hooks the leg. Is that kick to the head good enough? No, it only gets her a two. Minnie Makoto holding on. And oh, she gets a kick to the back of the head for her, her trouble there. Now Minnie Makoto trying to get back up as she can. And up and over and boom, down she goes. She holds on to the legs. One, two, and doesn't get it. And off the ropes and no, Minnie Makoto getting out of the way once again. Minnie Makoto just too smart and oh, out of nowhere with that thunderous spear from Minnie Makoto. And now a reversal, Minnie Makoto back up, back in action here. Now Minnie Makoto has her, got her all locked up now, and boom, backbreaker right across the back, and Minnie Makoto now up, out on top of the ropes, and oh, that's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. And the cover, the two, the three, that does it. Minnie Makoto with the victory there over Joanna Chase, proving to be no problem. You take a look here. That move didn't work. That didn't put her down. Getting the victory here. Minnie Makoto coming out on top. And oh, what, what is this? Relic Raider, she's out here. None too happy, obviously, about what happened earlier. The interference of the match. And oh my God, Relic Raider. As I said, not too happy with Minnie Makoto's interference earlier with her match against Vicky. But now Minnie Makoto sees what's going on, taking things into her own hands here. And now Minnie Makoto has her. Oh, she's got her up. And boom, down goes Relic Raider. Holy cow. And now, oh no, she's gonna get her in the corner. Here it is, boom, the spear taken out. Relic Raider, holy cow. Relic Raider taken down. And out goes Minnie Makoto out about her business. Holy cow, ladies and gentlemen.
It, you, you have so many spears, Mini Makoto. So many spears. You just bust them out out of nowhere. I can't help it. Obviously, with those sounds, the uh, tweets have been sent out. We are on the main event now. moves just spear 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 you'd be worse than freaking goldberg and freaking roman reigns combined just nothing but spears All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for our main event, and it is a tag team championship rematch. And now, here, co here they come, uh, the Blitz team sands their tag team titles after losing it in the tag team title match against Team Omni at the Death Battle pay-per-view in the cage, the steel cage match. They are here, but now here comes their opponents. The men they got to take down to get back their belts. There they are. The G1 Nation tag title holders, Cade and Renegade. Team Omni's here. And I doubt they want to get rid of those tag team titles. But Blitz team do have a rematch and they have called for it right here, right now on the Screw Attack Knockback. There they are, the G1 Nation Tag Champion. There they are, trying to get their titles back. Taylor, Brandon, the Blitz team.
Yes, there they are. They seem fine. Fancy free, all limbered up, ready to go. But remember, they have to defeat these two men, the men that took their titles in that cage match. Though this is not a cage match. Regular old tag team match here. Screw attack knockback right now. All right, there they are. Up for grabs here. Regular tag team title match coming your way. Looks like we got Brandon in first. Cade going in first for the champions. There's the bell. We are off, and here comes Brandon holding nothing back. And now, okay, there we are. Cade with that rising knee taking Brandon down. Oh, the elbow drop. Down goes Brandon. And now, uh oh, here they go. They're climbing up to the top goes Cade and oh no thinks better of it as Brandon trying to crawl away smart decision there and now uh oh here on the outside oh now he's waiting he sees Brandon he's waiting and up and over and oh catches him and out goes Brandon but quickly back in does not want to be counted out they cannot win that way that's for dang sure and now immediately Cade takes him down Now up and over goes Cade. Here we are now for the tag. Now Taylor's turning. Oh, big right hand. Cade sent flying off the ropes and up. And oh, reversal. Elbow to the head. And whoa, Cade wrecking house here. That is why they are the champions. But there we are now. Taylor with Cade there on the defensive side. Cade now in control. And oh, he's got him. And now just holy cow, just whipping him down back to the mat. As forcefully as he could. And now an elbow right to the chest. Now Taylor just taunting him, begging him to get back up. And as he does, he's immediately met by an onslaught here. And oh, You can tell that the Blitz team does not like the fact that their tag team titles were taken away, especially in a cage match of all things. So now they're definitely uh, gonna be giving it all, though right now Cade is in control here. Smart move, I believe going for the tag makes it, but Taylor quickly back up, but distracted. Allows Renegade to get the upper hand off the ropes. He goes and oh my goodness. But now here you see the experience that they have uh, culminated over the many matches here. Being a tag team and of course the experience of Renegade being a former G1 champ as well. Is now Oh, the reversal from Taylor. And oh, the reversal, Renegade taken down Taylor right there. Now kick right to the shoulder blades. And oh, quick spear, Taylor taken down. And now here we are in the corner. Oh, there we are. Now a nice big, gonna get stampeded by the Omniverse here. All over Taylor. And now here we go, last but not least, boom! Cade taking him down. And now, oh, quickly with the cover, he hooks that leg. One, two, only a two count. But now the ref is taken out. But nah, there we are, able to get back up all in due time. Thank goodness. 
And oh no, Taylor making a comeback here, taking down Cade. And now, whoa, quick switch up takedown right there. And now into the corner. Oh, but Taylor getting out. And now, oh man. Blitz team now. Oh no. Blitz team. Oh dear. Oh, that Blitz team buckle bomb taking them down. Now Brandon Legal Man going for the cover for the titles, but there's Renegade to bust it up. Gotta say that Blitz team buckle bomb boot right there. Quite something. But now Cade back up, back in action. Got Brandon. Oh no. Here comes Cade. Boom! That cascading kick from Cade taking down Brandon. Obviously, though, is taking a lot out of him. Is now Brandon trying to crawl to his corner. Cade stopping him. Not gonna let him get it. Now here we go. A cover. He hooks the leg. Is that good enough though? Oh, not gonna happen. Only a two count. And oh, elbow, Cade fighting. He's fighting now into the corner. And oh, big team maneuver coming. The Omni drop. And now here comes Taylor trying to interfere. The ref stops him. But now Renegade with the cover. One, two. No, near fall if I ever saw one. Hand on the way down. So Renegade gonna try and make him tap, but no. No, a little too close to the ropes there. And now Brandon is up. Oh, stomping on the arm here. And oh, elbow right to the back. Okay, here we go now. Renegade. On the warpath here, but no, Brandon with a reversal. But now here comes Taylor trying to cut in. Smartly getting back out before he gets disqualified and loses those titles. Oh, again with a stomp right to the face. But oh no, Renegade still, still has some steam left in his engine. Chop right there. Got him. Oh, man. And oh, oh, no. He's got him. He's got him all tangled up. Got those legs. Oh, man. Submission. Big submission here. Is Renegade going to tap? Are they going to get their time? Oh, nope. Renegade wiggling his way out there. He gets out. Holy cow. That was, got to say, that was a close one. But again, Brandon catching that leg. Over there in enemy territory, I think Renegade should definitely try and make a tag as, oh no, not another. It's another buckle bomb boot, here it comes, and boom! Down goes Renegade, Taylor coming in, making that cover. And now, one, two, and no, Renegade able to kick out. And now, oh, Taylor taking down Renegade. Swinging a miss there. Oh, man. Now, Taylor, oh, he's got him up. Oh, my goodness. Now, oh, Taylor with the snap back. But, oh, Renegade's still in this right there. Pushing him away. Now, off the ropes he goes. And again, oh, gonna stop himself as Taylor tries to crawl away. So Renegade gonna just stomp him down into the ground there. Now in comes what you want known as Cade. Uh-oh. Now Cade climbing. He needs to hurry. 
As Taylor's up and oh, he nails him from the top with that drop kick. Holy cow. And now Cade Wu over the shoulders he goes. That seems to have knocked some sense into Taylor here. And now it's got him. Oh, my goodness. How can he breathe after something like that? Now being sent into the corner. Now, uh-oh. Looks like we got some more double team maneuver. And, oh, a big punch right to the gut. But now Cade still got his wits about him into the corner with Brandon here. And now Taylor trying to intervene as he's being set up, but the ref stopping things here now. Up, setting him up in the top there. Cade, oh, that is a long way down, ladies and gentlemen. And he's going to four, a oh, long way down. He goes the whole length. But Cade not done, but neither is Brandon with that uppercut. And oh, he blocks it. Oh, the... The suplex and now off the rope and oh, Cade misses. He overjudged it just a little too much. And now I'm gonna quickly try for a one and a three count, a three count. But his hand was on the rope, the three count. They win. There you see that buckle bomb. And again, Team Omni win. There you see the misjudged leap from Cade as everybody looks on so he crawls over there it is he covers him he has the leg there's the one and there you see Brandon grabbing the rope and then the three count the ref didn't see it he didn't see it And there they are, still your tag champs. G1 Cade and Renegade. And that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks everybody for showing up here. So there you go, champ. You got your rematch and you lost, unfortunately.
Oh, so there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That's it for today. I mean, it sucks you didn't win or nothing like that there, champ. And so far, not 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 bad uh, damage done on the boss bar. But as I said, uh, that is it for today. So until tomorrow, I'm going to come probably going to be streaming some of that sweet, sweet space buddy action with the likes of a short bus, Eric. And if he's still at it right now. Uh, go over and uh, say hello to him. Because until next time, until tomorrow, whenever you want to come and see me, I'm out, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>